I'm a professional stri- This improv story is based on the idea a man adopts a cat, let the story commence. Craig was going to get a dog, and then he thought, no, I'm going to get a, a, I'm going to get a rabbit. And he was about to get a rabbit, and he was tweeting about it. I'm going to get a rabbit. People were going, a rabbit? Why a rabbit? Oh, rabbits are great. Rabbits are great. Oh, why a rabbit? Rabbits are actually great. And then he thought, oh, what well, then? Get a cat. And they said, no, people will get, you should get a rabbit. And he said, no, I've decided I'm not going to get a rabbit. I'm going to get a cat. Get a rabbit, seriously. And he went, well, no, I'm going to, I've decided I'm going to get a cat. Get a dog instead. Cats just sort of mind their own business. Dogs are your best friend. I've decided I'm getting a cat. I've decided. I have made the decision. I'm getting a cat. Oh, get a dog. I, th- I still think you should get a rabbit. Remember, you can get... It doesn't have to be mutually exclusive. It doesn't have to be a mu- mutually exclusive. It's not a zero-sum game. It's not a zero-sum game. It's not a zero-sum game. You can get a, you can get a cat and a, a rabbit. And he said, I'm no, I'm decided I'm going to get a cat. And anyway, have you got a cat and a rabbit? But the cat maybe know sometimes attack the rabbit. Don't be stupid. Why would the cat attack? If anything, I've got a cat and I've got two cats, the rabbit, and that rabbit terrorises the cats. But I don't think you should, arguments in his mentions between people who aren't even talking to him anymore. I don't think you should have that rabbit then attack the cats. No, I'm not saying anyway, it's none of your business. I'm not talking to you, I'm talking to Craig. Um, and he, he just went like, you know what, fuck it, blocked a lot of them. And then he got a message via, via somebody else, going to unblock my pal. Um, I think he blocked him accidentally when he was arguing with that person who was talking about the rabbits. And Craig went, no, I'm pretty sure I got the right people. It's just people arguing and not even talking to me anymore. Away you go. Could you unblock them, please? Right. You might be wondering why Craig was so popular. Craig was a musician and he thought right everybody so I'm going to get a car I'm thinking of getting this kind of car and then people went like that so you've got a specific kind of breed of car in mind and then you're going to go but but that sounds like that sounds like you but how can you know that that that's the car you're going to uh, be able to adopt adopt but you are adopting what? What? You said you're looking for a particular breed, but how would you know that that's what's going to be in the cat and dog home? I'm not going to cat and dog home. I'm going to, like, I don't know, look online. No, no, no! Don't buy, adopt, rescue. And what's this? Adopt a cat. People get cats, they go, oh, you know what? Pain in arse. Or, or dogs. I can know what. I didn't realise it was going to be so much hard work and they go and take the fucking back. Right? And they, they, they get killed. They get, you know, they put them down. And he went, oh, right. It's just. All oh, right. Adopt. I adopt. Craig, I was saying you should get a rabbit. I was saying you should get a dog. And even we are saying. If you're going to get a cat, right, all right, and, but adopt, adopt. He went, right. Why is it called, why is it, why is it called adopt and no just get? Because, you know, you've no got that cat. You know, you, you've went and got that cat that somebody else had. I know, but somebody always normally has a cat to begin with, you know, does that know the case? You don't, like, own the maw. Wait until the maw has the kittens and then you get the kitten. In fact, you're fucking adopting the maw. You're adopting... You're adopting the fucking maws. Cats, you know... It's not your fucking way. Do you know what I mean? If you think about it. It's all all adopting. In a sense. (laughs) Anyway, like... Anyway, so adopt. He went, right. So where do I, where do I go for that? It's not our job to uh, to educate you. And he went, all right, and we'll fuck it, I'm getting a rabbit then. Oh, good, you're getting a rabbit. 
Uh, in fact, no, I'm going to get. Uh, I'm going to buy a cat. I'm going to buy a, like, a kitten. I'm going to buy a kitten, a specific breed. Don't do that. Then tell me where to adopt. It's not our job. You're holding us to ransom. This is emotional blackmail. I'm no adopting unless you tell me where I can adopt for. I'm no dead it. You are the ones that suggested it. You tell me or I'm no dead it. You're a bad person, Craig. They said he's a member, he's a musician. He's in the papers, daily record the next day. Craig. He just went by the name Craig, by the way. Just Craig. That's what he's known as. Um, goads animal rights activists by saying that he's going to, um, you know, this and that. He's just reading all that. This is, he ended up tweeting. I didn't, I didn't say that. I was, I, was only, I was only joking anyway. Yes, everything's a big joke, isn't it? That just gets you everything. I was just joking. I was just joking. Gets you everything, didn't it? Um, I, I would like to adopt a cat. Can someone help me, please? And it's something like that. Everybody, let me get this. I can step you through it. I think you reacted badly. Craig, I think the way you, that you went about this was wrong. But I'm going to help you anyway. Because we all make mistakes. Um, where do you live? Um, well, what, 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 uh, Glasgow. There's various cats and dog homes kind of nearby. Listen, can I DM you? I don't want you dox yourself. What's do dox? What's that? Craig didn't know about th that term. He wasn't involved in streaming and stuff like that. Just to reveal your location. Um, and he went, right, what, what do I need today? Well, I'm following, you don't follow me, you need to follow me, So, or you can DM me. Right, it's just on Twitter. So he DM'd this person. Uh, it was a guy um, who had a picture of a cat, a picture of his cat in his profile picture. Um, and the guy said, all right, uh, where is it roughly? Yeah. Uh, don't worry, don't need to fucking tell me an address in that case you're a fucking, one of these fucking weirdos, one of these fucking nutters, fucking weirdos. He'd bangers. Don't worry about it. And Craig liked it, the, the way that this guy spoke by saying that, you know, fucking some amount of nutters out there, fucking he'd bangers and screwballs and all that. So he thought, he recognises that there are screwballs, he'd bangers and nut jobs and all that out there. That means he isn't one of them. Do you know, if he, if he talks about them as if there are other people and know him, that means he's not one of them himself. So he went like, listen, I'll just tell you, um, I stay uh, on this street. There's a one nearby. And honestly, he knew, Craig knew he made a mistake because the guy was getting back to him, back and forward. Right after that, the guy didn't get back to him. Um, are you looking that up to see? No reply. Then night came. By about it was dark outside by about eight o'clock. This is winter. Dark outside by about eight o'clock. And the door chopped. We call that chopping the door here. Door chopped. Craig answered the door. They couldn't there. Craig shut the door. Um Oh, what the fuck is that? I had a feeling it was that guy. And he went round the, the barkey's house and the, the back door was open. And Craig was like, oh, I don't remember leaving that door open. Uh If somebody fucking got in the back, you just had this feeling, did somebody just get in the fucking back door? Two people working together. I'm para. 
And he just sort of sat in his uh, kitchen for a bit, going, I'm a bit fucking worried here. And he went, he messaged that guy again. He said, are you, is that, so is there any cat adoption places nearby? In fact, it's fine, mate. I'm going to actually look it up myself. Thanks for your help. Thanks for your help. You've been a great help. Thank, thank you very much. I don't mean that sarcastically. Thank you. And just, and he, and he saw the, the three wee dots, dot, 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 typing behind you. Craig turned her in, and there was a guy in a cat costume with his prick out. And with one fucking motion, with a samurai sword, which is also known as a katana, took fucking Craig's head right off like that, man. Picked up the heat and pumped it. The end. True story. True story. Unfortunately. Unfortunately, that was not an improv story. It's a true story. Finally, I can come to terms with it. Finally, I can come to terms with it now that I've got it out and open. How do I know it's a true story? I was a cat. That was the cat man. The katana man. I katana. Katana. That's right. And it seemed the post caught with me. I went like Every word is true. How how am I free? How did they get out of jail? Animal rights activists broke in and opened up all the wee cages and I went. It was like something out of fucking Batman. 